Hi everybody. Okay, here's a question for you. What do you do if you make a mistake on a blanket, if you're crocheting a blanket? What do you do if the sides aren't even, if they kind of go this way or they go this way? What do you do, how do you fix it? Well, I ran into a situation just like that with this uh, blanket, this crocheted blanket that I made, um, and I did something rather unusual to fix it. So I wanted to share with you the mistake I made and how I fixed it. So as you can see, this is a baby blanket. It's not real big, but it's a baby blanket. And it's one of those kinds that has uh, different stitches and they're all in stripes. And I used a, somewhat of a pattern that I'd seen before and added my own um, variation on stitches and my own different pattern with making different colors at different places. Well, when I started, it started out fine and I seemed to be doing just fine, but then I realized that the edges were going in and then they would go, uh, they would go in, then they'd go back out and I just wasn't happy with it. So I ripped it out, the part I didn't like, and it was probably, oh, a, probably a section like from here, maybe down to here, I mean, it was a lot. And so I started again and then ran into the same problem. Now, granted, you are supposed to count your stitches on every row so that each one is exact, each row is exact. Well, I didn't do that. So what I ended up with, when I did it the second time, I ended up doing the same thing where it still ended up going this way. Now, this blanket is even on all sides and it turned out just fine but I wanted to share with you the mistakes that I made and so that you won't make the same mistakes. And if you happen to, you will at least have an option for maybe fixing it. Now, this is not recommended. I have to tell you, it is not recommended, but at least it works. Um, so what I did was, um, when the blanket is laid out, let me just lay it out here. Okay, the blanket is laid out and it looks just fine. I really like it. I really like the, how the colors turned out. I like the stripes. I like everything about it. I just don't like the edge. The edge, the, the border is fine. I really like the border. I found this pattern on, on a, a site and I really like it. I think it's cute. But um, what I ended up doing in order to get both of these sides straight, um, I was so frustrated that I decided to cut the edges. Yes, it's terrible. I ended up just cutting the edges on each side so that they would match. Well, obviously if you cut something that's uh, a crocheted thing, you're going to have loose edges and you're going to have frayed ends and they're all going to come apart. But what I did was I ended up taking um, a, a needle and thread and I ended up stitching along the edge so that none of these loose edges would come out. And then I went back over it in some places. I went back over it with the yarn doing a slip stitch to, con to finish tying off the loose edges if there were any. It actually worked. And I'm really, really happy about it, even though it is so unusual and it's just something I do not recommend. In this case, this just saved the blanket. And I'm really glad. And if you don't look close, you're fine. Um, and as a crocheter, of many years, I just it cr I cringe when I think about what how I ha was able to fix it. You never want to take scissors to your crocheted work to cut it or to trim it or anything. But you know what? This worked out just fine, and after I washed it, it turned out perfect. So this is going to be a gift um, to one of my girls, and it turned out fine. I really, really like it, but I would not, definitely would not recommend ever cutting an edge on a crochet blanket. So this is my story. This is how this turned out. I'm glad it turned out how it did, but I would not recommend doing it. So there you go.